you guys i hope you guys are doing good today so for all your tea sipping needs make sure you guys go to lovelytea.net and if you are an amazon prime member feel free to go to amazon.com forward slash because somebody told me it was a forward slash and not a backslash um forward slash shops forward slash lovely tea that's l-o-v-e-l-y-t-e-a so go there for all your tea sipping needs please don't forget to leave us a review thank you guys so much for the support and enjoy this video coming right on up okay so i hope you guys are doing good today honey so today is friday i am feeling good and green okay i have a new damn glass so you guys can watch me sip this tea okay because people are always asking what's in your cup there's actually tea in here for all the damn naysayers okay so anyways i hope you guys are doing really good today um i just got done along with men's of people watching aretha franklin home going and right now Aretha Franklin's home going is the number one trending topic on social media along with Jennifer Hudson Al Sharpton um, a lot of people are trending right now and I think her funeral was just so beautiful with so many people there from Tyler Perry to Whoopi Goldberg I hope she don't mind I don't think she would but I think I'm gonna come out of my shoes <laughs> Faith Hill even got up there and sang Ariana Grande. I guess she don't own no other type of black dresses, honey, okay? She was showing a little bit too much skin. She was showing a little bit too much damn skin for Auntie Aretha Franklin's funeral, okay? But she did the damn thing. But I think the funniest part of this entire funeral was when Al Sharpton got up there and caught himself trying to blast Trump and also him admitting to spelling the word respect wrong. And if that wasn't crazy enough, Michael Eric Dyson got up on stage and he showed the hell out, okay? Not only did Michael Eric Dyson go off, honey, but I had to clutch my invisible damn pearls and go run and grab a damn dictionary to look up some of them damn words that he was spitting. Go ahead and check this out, and I'm going to come back with the rest of my commentary. A lot of y'all corrected me. Now I want y'all to help me correct President Trump to teach him what it means. But besides that, I thought it was a really nice home going. Bill Clinton was there. There was a lot of people there to show Aretha Franklin the respect that she deserves. So rest in peace to the queen of soul, honey. Yes, nobody did it like Aretha. I'm still going to continue using her memes just like I use Whitney Houston's and Prince's and Michael Jackson's memes. So that way we can keep these people alive for this next generation. So that way they don't forget these people, these entertainers, these people who paved the way for your favorite artists to be where they are at today. So definitely rest in peace to Aretha Franklin for all the hard work, all her music, everything she's done to make the game what it is today. So in other news, I also want to let you guys know that if you guys do not know, Jay-Z and Beyonce are giving out over a million dollars worth of scholarships via the Boys and Girls Club. And the first person to win some scholarship money was a young man named Keyshawn Morgan, and he goes to Evans High School in Orlando. And DJ Khaled announced his name at the latest On The Run 2 concert. So Jay-Z and Beyonce are definitely doing the damn thing. They're definitely trying to give back. I want you guys to go ahead and watch this video really quick. Orlando, how y'all feeling tonight? 
Orlando, you better surprise somebody with a hundred thousand dollar on the one two scholarship presented by Beyonce and Jay Z through Bay Good and Charlotte Carter Foundation. Tonight, the person is in the building. We don't even know we gotta get a scholarship from Beyonce and Jay Z. So this is a surprise. This today's person is a senior, number three, graduate, class president of a theme of society. And I'm just going to get my degree this because I want to see the perfect because this is our senior. This is what it's about. President of Spanish Honor Society and a member of the UNICEF Club, Poetry Club. He was also talking about the Boys and Girls Club of Santa Fe. Where's the Boys and Girls Club? Where are they? I see you. Okay, I see you. The blue team is like that. I like that. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for it. The Orlando, the chosen one, for the All the World Teacher Scholarship, Kishan Morgan. Oh my gosh. All right, so you guys just saw that video, DJ Khaled, and you guys just saw the winner. So he is just one of many people. They're going from city to city, and they'll be announcing different winners via the Boys and Girls Club. So kudos to Jay-Z and Beyonce for giving back to the youth. Anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. How do you guys feel? Did you guys get a chance to watch Miss Aretha Franklin's Homecoming? Did you guys enjoy it? What was your favorite part? And then how do you guys feel about Jay-Z and Beyonce giving out that scholarship to lucky fans across the country? So let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. All right, deuces.
Hey you guys, it's your girl T and I hope you really enjoyed that video. If you wanna know more about my look of the day or if you want a way to contact me concerning advertisement and sponsorship deals, definitely feel free to click my description box. There's plenty of information in there. Please stay tuned for the next video. Talk to y'all later.